how to professionally set up and shut down the Froth Pack 600 Series Kit. You need the Froth Pack Spray Foam 600 Series, Tyvek hooded coveralls, eye protection and respirator with organic vapor and P100 cartridge, nitro gloves, and a trash bin. The hose assembly should include cone nozzles, fan tip nozzles, packet of petroleum jelly, InstaFlow dispenser with hose, instructional manual, and a disposable wrench. First, make sure all flame sources are extinguished. Then, prep the area and double check the manual. Then, safely remove the tanks from their boxes. Next, check that the kit contents are optimally between 21 and 32 degrees Celsius. Then, mix the tanks. Next, uncoil the hose and attach the red marked hose to the A tank and attach the blue marked hose to the B tank. Then, tighten all the connections with the included wrench. Now, coat the inside face of the InstaFlow dispenser with petroleum jelly. Fully open both tank valves. Then check for product flowing through lines. If there's no product, shut tanks off immediately and check the troubleshooting guide in the manual. Pull the trigger of the InstaFlow dispenser and spray until both streams are equal. Wipe down the dispenser face and apply more jelly. Push the nozzle firmly into the InstaFlow dispenser. Hold the dispenser at least 15 centimeters away from the spray area and fully engage the spray trigger when you're ready. Avoid pauses of more than 30 seconds while spraying to prevent foam from curing in the nozzle. Once spraying is complete, push down on the ejector to remove the nozzle. Next, clean the product from the dispenser face with a clean rag. Then reapply one last coat of petroleum jelly and firmly reinsert the used nozzle once more. Close both cylinder valves and store. Reuse froth pack for up to 30 days. Continue ventilating the area for at least another hour. And that's how easy it is to set up, spray, and get on to the next job with the Froth Pack 600 series.